I had one of those moments of ins total inspiration. I don't know if you would call it a moment of inspiration, but it was a moment that made me stop and it made me think. And I realized that the only thing that could prevent me from coming closer to Kadosh Baruch Hu is me. And the only thing that could keep me further from a Kadosh Baruch Hu is me. Wow. That means that I can't throw the responsibility onto anybody else and I can't put the blame onto anybody else for not being close to a Kadosh Baruch Hu. It's all coming from me. That's true? Yes! We see in this week's parsha, HaKadosh Baruch Hu calls the Moshe Rabbeinu and it says, Vayikra. He calls him with the Aleph, with the, with the love. Hashem's calling him. It's not, with, it's not by chance. It's not a coincidence. It's not that just things happen in my life for no reason. There's a love there. There's a closeness there. There's, Hashem's calling Moshe. And then this parsha opens up the whole entire Sefer of Vayikra about all the korbanot, all these offering, these korbanot. What's this word korbanot from the word? Offering sacrifice is karev, karov, to be close. Hashem is calling us, and what is He saying? He's saying there's this way to get close to Kadosh Baruch Hu, and you think it's only on the outside? You think somebody has to pull you, inspire you? You think that if somebody says something to you, then you're going to run away, and you'll get further from Hashem? You can just blame them? You're going to get close to Hashem? You can just rely on them? What is Hashem saying? What's a korban? It says in the Pasuk, when it talks about the korban of Mincha, it says, the nefesh ki takriv korban Mincha Hashem. Rashi brings, what is this? What is this Mincha? What is this offering of a Mincha? He says, first of all, it's called nefesh, not a dam. It says, says soul, the soul who brings tikarev, who comes close with this korban, this offering, Mincha Hashem. A soul. Why a soul? Because the Mincha was for a poor person. This was a sacrifice offering of a poor person. We didn't have a big cow. We didn't have a goat. He had just some flour and he brings this and Hashem says, this to me is more dear than the most expensive thing. Why? Because you're bringing you. So a person says, how could I possibly come close to Kadosh Baruch Hu? I need something to bring me close or this thing is pushing me afar and it's not true. Hashem is just saying the only thing that you need and I'm calling you, I love you, I'm calling you affectionately, is you. Zat Hashem, we should always feel close to Kadosh Baruch Hu. Shabbat Shalom.